Hi, DAX is the third course in our Power BI learning path after foundation data modeling. DAX is a calculation language of Power BI and a very powerful language. This course gives you a head start in writing workable, effective DAX. We'll start by building examples of the three types of object that DAX can create. For example, here this PL measure or a number measure called observations. DAX can also create calculated columns, for example, this breach status calculated column here. And finally, DAX can create tables like this axis parameter table here. We'll get lots of hands on practice in lab exercises using the common DAX functions. We'll go into the theory, we'll learn the difference between aggregator functions and iterator functions, between scalar functions and table functions. We'll understand the concept of row context and also filter context. And we'll understand why the calculate function is so important because as in this example here, it can change the external filter context. It's a very pragmatic course and we cover the typical use cases that you're likely to need. For example, time intelligence. We might start off by building a year to date function very concisely using this inbuilt dates YTD function. We could do the same for quarter to date, but we do it in a much more back to basics way. So we kind of understand the pattern and that lets us build things like this 30 day moving average because we understand the pattern of what's going on. We'll write most of our DAX calculations in Power BI desktop. But occasionally we'll use this wonderful free tool here, DAX Studio, uh, to write our DAX. It helps us to understand what happens in large calculations step by step. There are more details about our course, including the agenda and the topics on our website. Link to that in the description below. If you are interested in us running the course for you, we can do it virtually, we can do it in, in person, and we can tailor the course for you exactly to your requirements. So please do get in touch.